Hey guys, it's Kristen. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be filming a video that has been very requested by a lot of you and that is how I learned every single muscle in the body for anatomy in physical therapy school. If you've been subscribed to my channel for a while, I made a video about a year ago now talking about how I study for anatomy. I think it's titled How to Get an A in Anatomy. But the way my physical therapy school sets it up is we take Gross Anatomy 1 our first semester and Gross Anatomy 2 our second semester and the first class is pretty much all of the extremities and the second class is the spine. And the way the course was structured was we would go through a body part, so hip, knee, ankle, foot, etc, etc, and we would have an exam over each little part of the body if that makes sense. So every single week we would be assigned 10 muscle cards to memorize the function, nerve, origin, and insertion of. And we'd have to do 10 a week and then we'd have a quiz on those muscles. So in my how to get an A in anatomy video I talked about how I studied and memorized that. So in summary what I did was I would take out my atlas which this is the Gilroy's third edition Atlas of Anatomy and I love this book. I have it all bookmarked off and I still use that all the time and I would also utilize my coloring book a lot because it's kind of more of an interactive way to learn so it's a little bit more fun and it kind of feels like you're taking a break from studying and this is by Win Pitt but I oftentimes would still find it super hard to just stare at the table of muscle cards that my teacher would give us for the quiz that week. I would always, always, always dread studying them. I would struggle to pay attention and it just was it just was really hard for me to get them down and I feel like I just was not studying effectively and I was not spending my time wisely. I had to make quizlets and then I would never even look at them. I tried handwriting flashcards, that didn't work either, so I a lot of the time would just end up staring at the chart on my computer and then staring at my atlas or the coloring book and it was just not effective. So I wanted to talk about this website that I started using towards the end of my anatomy courses and that is KenHub. So KenHub is an interactive and fun way to master muscles, function, nerve, origin, and insertions in physical therapy school. They have tons of interactive features to promote learning in a way that isn't passive and isn't boring. A lot of times when I was trying to study my paper muscle cards, like I said, I would find it really hard to pay attention, but with KenHub, there are tons of interactive videos, quizzes, and online atlases to promote interactive learning. For example, say you had to learn all about the different shoulder muscles, such as the rotator cuff muscles. You can just click on the little option for the upper limb portion, and it will take you over to a video where you can get a good foundation on these muscles. Then you can go through and quiz yourself and reinforce the general background information provided. KenHub also has their own anatomy reference charts available for download as well. So you can kind of split your screen and look at that chart while also looking at their interactive atlases. So like I said, I didn't find out about KenHub till kind of later on in my second semester of PT school, so I did use it for the last few weeks of that semester, but if I had had this from day one of PT school, it honestly would have saved me so much time, so much stress. It is just such an effective way to learn, particularly anatomy and the muscles, which is like the most important thing in physical therapy school, because if you have that good solid foundation then that is just going to put you on track to be an awesome awesome physical therapist so if you want to check out KenHub you can check out the description box down below I have a discount code that I'll put on the screen here for you guys to get 10% off of your KenHub membership. Another tip of advice I have for you guys for memorizing every single muscle in the body is absolutely do not cram do not try to cram everything into your head a day or two before the quiz or the test or whatever. If your school doesn't require you to have weekly muscle quizzes, just make a plan. Say, I'm going to learn this many muscle cards this week, this many next week, and just constantly be reviewing them. Right now, I am in my second year of the program, semester four, and I'm obviously not in anatomy anymore, but I still am going through using the KenHub features 
also still using my atlas and my coloring book and just constantly reviewing those muscles because like I said it is super super important because if you don't know the muscles how are you gonna know what is wrong with your patient and how to help them another super important tip I have for you guys is do not try to memorize the muscle cards without any context so don't just write out a flashcard with a muscle function nerve origin insertion and just try to memorize them with no context at all having no idea what that nerve is no idea what that motion is no idea what that bony landmark is you really need to have an atlas out or an interactive atlas out and memorize okay this muscle goes from here to here it is innervated by this nerve and all the other muscles in this area are also innervated by that nerve just kind of try to group things together and make sense of it because when I was first trying to learn the muscles I feel like I would just try to memorize word for word with no context and that made it super hard so if you do have a little chart of all the muscles that your teacher gives you or that you make or if you're using the one on KenHub go through and really really put some context to it try to highlight similarities between the muscles whether that be the function the nerve the origin insertion and make little mnemonics just try to group them together because in one sense it is pure memorization but in another sense there is a little bit of reason and logic to it so you just need to figure that out so yeah that's how i learned every single muscle in the body just by not cramming putting a little bit of time in every single day using interactive features such as KenHub, and also utilizing paper atlases and my adorable little coloring book so i hope you guys found this helpful and if you did, please be sure to leave me a comment and subscribe down below because I post new videos every single Saturday about my journey in physical therapy school and I would love to have you here for my PT school journey. So I will talk to you guys next week. Bye friends!